YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, and today we're back in Motor Town, and folks, I finally did it. I hooked up the trailer. I did the thing. Uh, I couldn't do this last episode for some reason. I feel like it was, like, glitched out or something. But yeah, it's hooked up to the truck, so we can actually take on uh, trailer jobs, which I'm assuming I just need to load up, like, a big pallet or something. Also, here's the control panel. So what does this do? Lock, uh, roadside service, uh, cargo. Oh, cargo. Wait. Is this a control panel for this, or how does this actually work? You know what? I think it's gonna be fine. Let's just drive it over to the loading bay and see if we can uh, load some stuff up here. So if I were to park here, is this gonna load up in the truck or the trailer? By the way, am I renting the trailer? That's a good question. I was able to just pick it up as if it was mine. So yeah, here we go. Let's go ahead and do a pallet here. We probably really wanna go up north. So let's do this pallet here and then look it automatically loads the one up in the back can i load another one oh i can take both of these so by the way if you guys are enjoying motortown on the uh, channel you know what to do hit that thumbs up button do i have to strap stuff in here man we could totally fit a couple more boxes maybe we'll do like a bit of a trip here uh we'll see if we can find some more stuff to take along the way but we could loop around to the top side of the map uh because yeah there's like totally room for boxes back here so here let's load up some apples Load those up in the back. There we go. Can I fit anything else? I'm trying to cram as much stuff. Actually, I think everything just grayed out. So that's all we can take. So we have apples and two pallets. And we are on our way. So yeah, uh, we're going to test this vehicle out. I kind of want to do the ambulance job too, because I feel like that would be kind of fun. Uh, maybe there's an incentive to maybe rush along and try to uh, get the patients to the hospital. But you know what? It's nice to be able to uh, actually take all this cargo. I'm kind of curious though. Am I going to have to do profit share? Oh, that's a cop. Okay. You know, it's a miracle he decided not to pull me over there. Also, eventually I will unlock that charger. We should do more police chases too. Wait, I wonder if you could put a trailer hitch on the police car. That'd be kind of cool too. Uh, still curious if I'm going to have to profit share with the trailer. I'm hoping not. Uh, hopefully I get all of the money, but you never know with this game. Totally checking my phone while driving. Fine. All right, looks like we're gonna get some open highway here. Also, there's a cement truck. There's a cement job too. There's like jobs for everything in this game. Uh, there's probably some more I haven't even discovered. So if you guys know of any, uh, anybody who's played this, let me know. You guys think we can cut across the grass? That is a really unnecessary road. Let's just go this way. Yeah, this is perfectly safe with the trailer, right? Oh, geez. Oh, there's a cop over there. Hopefully they didn't notice what I just did there. Yeah, that road like goes all the way over there to the right and my drop off points like right ahead of us here. Total waste of time. Komodo's really, really efficient when it comes to deliveries. Here we go. So we are dropping off here at the farm. I wonder if we could pick something up and take it to our destination. Actually, what are we taking over here? It's a good question. What am I unloading? Oh, it was the big pallets. Do you guys have a pickup point? Oh, they don't, but look at that. There's a RV. What's the point of the camper? Can we actually go in it? Can we see inside of it? Yeah, we can rent it for some reason, but I don't really get the point of that one. All right, we have three more boxes to deliver. I was hoping there was gonna be a pickup point here. That way, maybe we could take some stuff to our uh, destination. Is there anything in this area? Oh, this area is pretty bare looking. All right, well, we need to make our way back up to the harbor town. All right, you guys think I can do another shortcut here? No, look, we're getting some, uh-oh, uh-oh. That's not good. Uh-oh, I can't even get out of here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This is really not good. Okay, roadside service. Can you come tip me? <gasps> no, that's our trailer. We need that. Uh, tow to nearest road. A thousand dollars. Wow. Not gonna lie, I'm a little salty about that. We flew through the air with our, uh, our trailer and then we proceeded to waste all the money. Yeah, now we're only, uh, we've only made about $400. Great. Do we even still technically have a delivery right now? That is a good question. We might have just screwed this up. Komodo is a genius, by the way. You guys didn't know that? Okay, lift that back up. Can we please get this back? Oh no, there's a chance we are totally screwed here. Well, somebody's not getting their apples. Look, we were able to hook it back up. Okay, so we are back in business. So let's just go ahead and interact with this. All right, so that's back up. Okay, you know, this is why everybody gets on to me in my comment section going, Komodo, why do you drive like this? 
Yeah, I understand now. Uh, it's, trust me, point taken. I I'm going to go ahead and get over to the road. So yeah, we lost $1,000 there. That's nice. But yeah, I was telling myself, I'm not sure how, like, I'm going to actually get up to these really high levels for, say, like, the Charger police car or even the cargo, like, the semis and stuff. They take, like, level 20, but... Uh, the bigger stuff you do and the more cargo you can pile on, you actually level up relatively quick in the game. And I, I didn't actually think it was that quick. I thought, man, this game's really grindy, but no, it really isn't. All right, so we are dropping off. Wait, I think we dropped off these people last episode. It was like uh, bananas or oranges or something. All right, well, you guys get a drop off here. Can I take that truck? That is a sweet looking truck there. Can we rent you? What, what do we have to be for this one? Oh, only five. And what, that would haul like gravel or something? Oh, and they got something we could pick up here. Can we load up and head back into town? I'm um, back it up. Okay, we might need to make the loop here. Yeah, what would a construction site have? Like what materials? Okay, I'm gonna pick up the delivery here. What do you have? Oh, it's a concrete sand dump. So yeah, you have to have a truck like that. That makes sense. All right, so we are not picking up from this. So our best bet, you know, I feel like we should do one more job here. Where's our nearest pickup? We have a pickup. That's a delivery point over by the airport. Maybe we'll pick up from there. They got more trailers in here where the Harbor Raceway is, which we haven't done this race. That might be something that we can do in the future too. Uh, so technically, I think this is the hospital. We haven't been there either. You know, let's go take this over there. And then maybe if we have time, we'll do another cargo job or maybe even some more police chases. We need to level up pretty much everything. All right, here we are, St. Mary's Hospital. Do they trust Komodo enough to drive a ambulance? <laughs> you serious? That is a good question. What do you have to be? Uh, can I drive this? Oh, it's a level. Wait, this is for the taxi. So yeah, it's a level 10. Oh yeah, they really don't trust me to do that. Well, cargo jobs it is. <laughs> I thought I was going to get to drive something really neat today. I guess we're stuck with our truck. I mean, our truck's still pretty cool though. All right, here we are. We're going to pull in. Uh, hello. Can I have some cargo, please? Uh, I've arrived at my destination. Can I pick up from these spots? Where's your pickup spot at? I mean, obviously it kind of looks like these, but do I have to have a different vehicle? Oh, there it was. Uh, yeah, it's really close to the, the bay here. Oh, come on, come on, there we go, nice. It just was uh, grinding my truck up against the building, it's fine. All right, so let's load up this pallet here. Can I load a second one? Okay, so we could take two of those pallets. Uh, and, oh, something just disappeared. I was looking for what else we can uh, put down or take down to the south. Because I think it's where the, the police station is. So uh, I'd like to be down there. That might be it, though. All right. So Komodo's not going to go off-roading anymore. We're going to try to stay on the road. But that doesn't mean I can't go fast. Oh, no. What am I doing? <gasps> okay. Sorry, Mr. Cement Truck. Uh, I'm trying not to damage my own vehicle. Because, yeah, I own this. And I would have to pay the uh, repair fees. Unlike if I didn't own this. Also, I just now realized... When we uh, dropped off those last uh, deliveries, uh, we didn't pay any sort of sharing fee, I don't believe. So, is the trailer is already ours? I don't know. It's kind of weird. We'll see in this next little drop-off. It's uh, 2.9 kilometers away. All right, here we are. Drop-off once again. Okay, pay attention. How much are we going to make for this? Let's go. Boom. Hello, we're here. Oh, this is the wrong drop-off point. Komodo's stupid. <laughs> I have been looking at my phone, which is not a very good example, especially if you were really driving in real life. So please do not take uh, anything that I say or any of my driving style into account into your own driving style because I don't want to get sued for anything. Uh, of course, you should already know this if you watch my Beam and G episodes. Yeah, I was texting and I looked up, I was like, hey, this is our drop off and it totally wasn't our drop off. This is our drop off. Okay, so here we go. Let's go ahead and see what we make here. No profit sharing, right? Boom, that was 300. Oh, get this one in there. There we go. So yeah, 300. I don't see anything about profit sharing, so we are good to go on that front. So real quick question. How much are some of these other vehicles? I mean, we're close to $10,000. Uh, I kind of like this one. I think I can only rent this one. Uh, I'd really love to have this semi, though. Look at this. Uh, I can jump into its seat, but I can't actually uh, 
I can't actually drive it. It's like a you can look, but you can't really touch situation. So if I try to jump into here. So this one's a level 15, which are actually, yeah, it's a level 30 on driving, which we'll have that probably by the time we get level 15 on cargo. Uh, so that one's not too bad. What about this one? What is this little thing? This is kind of cute. Wait, is this? Oh, geez. Okay, I'm running into stuff. Does this have more space than the truck? It's debatable. I kind of feel like it does. Yeah, look at that. How much are these? Uh, this might not be a bad option to buy. Maybe when we want to upgrade our truck. Actually, we could just upgrade the truck. Hold on, let's take it over to the tuning shop. Maybe we could just make it faster. I don't think we can make it haul more, but hold on. Let's drive into here. Is it safe to do this with a trailer? No. Okay, I think we're good. So yeah, uh, any repairs? Let's go ahead and repair all. Make sure things at max. And then parts. So powertrain. Can I upgrade the engine here? Oh, look at that. We can add, uh, it's 180 horsepower. So right now, I, oh, we don't even have this, do we? Hey, what is our current dyno compared to what we have right now? Obviously, 180 horsepower V8. That'd be an upgrade, right? Man, they have a 320 horsepower one. Hold on, so can I buy this? So yeah, the 140 is installed. So let's go ahead and buy and install. So I own this one. Can I sell this? Oh yeah, you could sell your old motors. There we go. So we made some of the money back. All right, so another thing we can do, let's get the large sized radiator because we overheat quite a bit. So let's go boom, buy and install, and then we'll sell this one. Oh, that's only worth 50 bucks. All right, well, we've actually upgraded our truck. So we should be able to make deliveries a little bit more efficiently. Now I had another question. Hold on, let's go and back this out. Can we upgrade the police car? That's a good question. Oh yeah, this definitely feels like it's got a bit more motor and it's got a better radiator in it. Wait, what would the 320 horsepower be like? That would almost be too much, I think. Oh, I think the police station's that way. Oh, yes. Feel that power. Nice. Oh, man, it's so tempting to jump off-road again. <laughs> yeah, we'll just park it across a couple spots. That's fine. So, I don't think I technically own this. I just get to drive this. But can we take this and put, like, a trailer hitch on it? Oh, we just hit a person. Yeah, if we could do that, we could uh, run police chases while doing some sort of delivery so that's uh maximizing your uh, time there all right can we uh install oh i think we can oh we can only repair oh that stinks wait what's the second area for is it the same thing maybe it's just for bigger vehicles yeah well that stinks i was hoping to upgrade the police car uh this one could definitely use another motor this is not the charger. All right, so we are out on patrol. The sunlight is blinding. You know, I'm surprised there's not a separate level for police. And oh, watch out. Oh, wow. I feel like the police and the ambulance level should almost be tied together. Oh, we just murdered somebody. Okay, this is fine. Oh, <laughs> hi, cop. Okay, we're like not getting any suspects at all. I kind of want to just pull somebody over. Can I just pull you over? Is that a thing? Hey, pull over. Oh, he's pulling over. Maybe he, I don't know, robbed the bank up here or something. Nope. Anything? We run? I can't even, like, get people to run from me right now. I mean, while we wait, I mean, we can always uh, rip around the track a little bit, right? Yeah, this is something you would love to see the cops doing. Have a little local racetrack and they're just out there just having fun racing, not doing their job. Uh, look at this. Uh, we've activated the, uh, the time. This is definitely going to be faster than our muscle car, I think. Oh, yes. Look at that. Let's see if we can get a good time in real quick. Does this help with a, a different, like, I think this helps with, like, a racing level or something when we cross the line. We'll see. Uh, we're still waiting for suspects, but the game doesn't seem to want to give us any, which is kind of discouraging. I'd love to chase somebody right now. Uh, this is fun. Wait, are you serious? Oh, we got a, a pursuit. Hold on. I got to finish my lap real quick, and then we're going to turn on the sirens, and we are going to go on a chase. All right, what kind of lap are we going to get here? Come on. All right, there we go. Uh, we got a hundred, uh, XP up for a racing level. Okay, I did not realize that was going to be a, a wall there. Oh, it's getting dark. It's going to be hard to see here, huh? Let's go. Oh, no, no, I jumped out of the car. I jumped out of the car. It's so hard to see right now. Okay, jump back in, jump back in. Okay, drive. I was meaning to switch cameras. Okay, where is the suspect? Oh, the camera does not help me. It gets unbelievably dark for a little bit in the game, and then the, uh, the moonlight kind of kicks back up. Okay, I can see lights in the distance. This is dangerous. What are we doing? Uh, so it feels like something's broken in my car. Okay, I can see lights in front of us. I see another police car. I think there's two suspects running. 
Come on, Moonlight. Give me a little bit of light here. This is bad. Uh, I can't see a thing. I'm just trying to follow the yellow line. All right, I see the lights. We're getting close. We're going to overtake the first cop. Okay, they're splitting. We'll take the right suspect. We'll give the other cop the suspect to the left. All right. Oh, there's the sun. Kind of looks like the apocalypse out here. Is that a taxi? Oh, that's a taxi cab. Did somebody steal this? Oh, he just stopped. Okay. Pin him. Uh, you're not going anywhere, buddy. There we go. We got that one. Uh, oh, you've got to be kidding me. I think a Prius just sped by us. Come on. We got the other cop coming down the road. We're going to pin him here. This is going to be excellent. Oh, no, don't run into me. Oh, no. Okay. Yep, we just broke the engine. I'm not sure what we learned here today. We learned that the cops, uh, they're also dangerous in the game along with everything else. But we earned some money. We finally got to do a trailer job. And you know what? We'll see you guys next time. Uh, yeah, we got a lot of damage over here. <laughs>